Uh, mother and daughter together for a cool segment I want to end the show with. You know, uh, this show, we're well, going to use this platform on this show to raise awareness as we go back to school in about a month. And two topics that I, I've chosen to raise awareness is teen smoking and teen obesity. Across America, one out of three teens are obese, and smoking is off the charts. Dan, you're going into 10th grade. Talk about how those uh, two uh, uh, things, uh, teen smoking and, and teen obesity, that you noticed being at Long Beach High School with kids smoking and being overweight. Well, first of all, just the overweight part. Um, it is sad to see people overweight, but I feel that Long Beach High School does a, a great job of uh, doing extracurricular activities such as sports and the surf club. And uh, with surfing, it keeps you fit. With any sport, it keeps you fit. So I feel that the Long Beach High School is doing a great job of keeping kids not fat. And the lunches there, they have been trying to get a little bit healthier. And yeah, that's what I can see. And the smoking epidemic is big. And uh, the teachers are enforcing it, making sure that kids aren't smoking. But yeah, the smoking and obesity are two big things. And uh, I want to raise awareness of that. Thanks. So talk about, as a parent, addressing those two important uh, areas. Food for a teenager is, I think, the toughest because no matter how good of an example you set, they're still going to want pizza and Dr. Pepper. They're still <laughs> going to want that. Um, for smoking, uh, I think you have to lead by example. With, with everything, but with smoking, you have to not smoke. You have to not support it. How about the fact that, you know, now you have the internet and video games and instead of kids going out and getting exercise and, and doing something healthy, they're sitting in front of their television, their computer, their video games, and that's not good for getting good exercise for their bodies. Well, uh, again, leading by example, uh, I'm a, a person who goes to the gym every day. I'm very involved with keeping active and keeping fit, and I think parents need to shut the TV off, shut the video games off, and get the kids outside. Well, we, we want to uh, address this program, not just the kids in Long Beach, and I applaud, you know, the, the departments in Long Beach, but I, I think we got to get the message all out there because um, I think it's important at this age, especially where kids are just forming, that if they start developing bad habits, being obese and smoking, it's just going to lead to bad health down the road. I think, um, we see that more and more now, and you know I deal with the elderly. People who eat horribly young end up with problems later on. And if we can instill in that to say, you know what, in the moment is gonna be later on, we need, we need to send that message. Excellent. Lisa, Dane, thank you so oh, much, because this is gonna be a big part of our show moving forward. All right, we have some great guests tonight. Let's give it up for author Stephen Miller with a top book. Give it up for the top singers who are awesome. And how about Miss Long Island? And our regulars were awesome. Rocco was awesome. Rich Kaplan was awesome. Joe Santriano. Dane and Lisa. What great staff. And now we've run out of time. And let me wrap with this. My name is Halftime. I want to thank you for your time. Please join us next Sunday for the show of Halftime. But at this time... We are out of time. See you next Sunday.